Commander Shepard. Commander, the people of the Alliance have questions. Commander Shepard, Kalisa Bint seen in Al Jalani. Isn't it true that you were on Earth when the Reapers attacked? How do you justify running away while millions of people on Earth die? Is that the best we can expect from the Alliance? I came to get help for Earth. For everyone. What about all the people suffering while you play politics with the Council? What about them? How can you stand here while our families die? What are you going to do? The same thing I've been doing for the past three years. Find a way to stop the Reapers. Get some help, Kalisa. I have work to do. Incursions by enemy forces are being reported in Turian colonies. Fighting is said to have reached Paladin. Hey, Commander. Liara told me the Council's not interested in helping us. Something like that? <laughs> Why would they? Look at this place. There's no war here. People are whispering about it. They're talking about it. But they don't really believe it. I can hardly believe it myself. Like everything back on Earth was some kind of nightmare. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I hate most. It's like this place wants you to forget that. So, you still want to go back to Earth? Hell yeah, but... But? You were right. So was Anderson. We can't stop them alone. Besides, looks like you're gonna have your hands full convincing these pendejo politicians to help us. And I'm up for it. Whatever it takes. Glad to hear it. I'm gonna head down to some of the lower levels where they keep it real. You got some spare time? You should come and find me. Maybe I'll do that. Ilium is under attack. Although the Asari colony is across the galaxy from Paladin and Earth, the invading force appears to be the same that... It... attack those planets. According to the Council, these galaxy-wide attacks are part of a massive and organized invasion plan. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please select a destination. Areas tagged of interest to you are highlighted on the elevator menu. One moment, please. at Docking Bay D-24.
Ayara, can I help you? I've been forwarding the Turian Counselor information on the Prothean device. It can't be built without Council support, but he's not budging until their Primarch is safe. I know. Are you alright? I didn't get what you'd call a good night's rest. There's more to it than that, isn't there? What's really bothering you? When the Reapers hit, I could hear people screaming in the streets below me. We left a lot of them behind. There's no way for you to save them all. But I know you're doing everything you can, and you'll get back there in time to help. I hope you're right. Don't blame yourself, Commander. Commander Shepard? I'm Specialist... Oh. Uh, I, I beg your pardon. I thought you were alone. I was just leaving. Commander Shepard, I'm Comm Specialist Samantha Trainer with Alliance R&D. I was part of the team retrofitting the Normandy after you turned it over to the Alliance. There weren't many of us aboard when the Reapers hit. Slow down, Specialist Trainer. You're doing fine. Thank you. I worked in a lab. I never thought I'd be serving on a ship. Why don't you tell me about the retrofits? The ship's in line with Alliance regs now, and it has new, top-of-the-line, quantum entanglement communicators. In fact, Admiral Anderson had intended to use the Normandy as his mobile command center. That's no longer an option. Yes, I heard he chose to stay and fight. I in any event, I'm honored to serve under you, Commander. For as long as you need me, that is. They only sent me here to oversee the retrofits. Shepard, some of our systems require further testing, and Specialist Trainer has been extremely effective during installation. I would prefer that she remain. Got it, Edie. Oh, wait, since when does a virtual intelligence make requests? Edie's an AI. Fully self-aware. Oh, I knew it. I knew Joker was lying. Jeff requested that I pretend to be a simple VI to protect myself. I apologize for the deception. Thanks, E.D., and I apologize for all those times I talked about how... attractive your voice was. Anyway, shall I give you a tour? I think you'll be impressed by the new upgrades. In the CIC, you'll find the galaxy map, where you can set the Normandy's destination. You can also check your messages at your private terminal. The War Room houses a strategic command center for mission-specific intel and war analysis. The shuttle bay contains an armory, where you can modify your equipment between missions. Finally, Liara has set up a lot of hardware down in the old XO office on Deck 3. I think she's claimed that room. And there you are. Still the same ship as before, it just flies Alliance colors now. Speaking of which, I believe Admiral Hackett would like to speak to you at the VidCom. Commander. Udina updated me on your meeting with the Council. Sounds like they're running scared. We did present them with a lot of unknowns. They're feeling threatened and want immediate solutions, not theories. Theories are all we've got right now. What's your plan? I'm trying to get the Turian Primarch for a summit meeting with the Asari and Salarians. I'll bypass the Council and appeal directly to their leadership. That's good, I like it. 
This is where we start laying the groundwork for our counterattack. Unfortunately, we don't have a whole lot to back it up right now. Then build alliances. Gather everything and everybody you can for the cause. What about the Prothean device? Find me people who can help build it, and if you can't, I'll take ships, soldiers, supplies, whatever you can get. We need to keep hitting the Reapers across every theater of war they open. Buy us time to figure out the device. And when it's finished? Assuming it ever is, we pool all our resources. Think of it as a giant armada for delivering the device, when the Reapers are most vulnerable. The stronger you can make that armada, the better the chances of punching through. What about Earth, sir? We'll just have to hope Anderson and what's left of the Alliance forces can hold out until we've dealt with the enemy. I understand. Good. Then make it happen, Commander. I'll be expecting regular updates on your progress. Hack it out. The Alliance has found a new Cerberus lab on Sanctum. Admiral Hackett would like you to investigate.
Oh no. No. Palavin. We have an old friend there. Holy hell. They're getting decimated. Strongest military in the galaxy and the Reapers are obliterating it. Was it like this on Earth? Yes. Shepard. I'm so sorry. Yeah. Commander, the LZ's getting swarmed. James, open that hatch. Tabestic, get your men up on that north barricade. Yes, sir. Sergeant Bardas, find a way to get that comm tower operational. Sir. General. Commander Shepard, heard you were coming, but I didn't believe it. General Corinthus. I've come to get Primarch Fedorian. Primark Fedorian is dead. His shuttle was shot down an hour ago as it tried to leave the moon. That's gonna complicate things. I'm sorry. I hear he was a good man. And a friend. He would have been an outstanding diplomat. So what happens now? The Turian hierarchy provides very clear lines of succession. Right. General Corinthus? With such heavy casualties, it's hard for me to be certain who the next Primarch is. Palavan Command will know. However, at the moment, contacting them is impossible. The comm tower is out. Husks are swarming that area. We can't get close enough to repair it. Don't worry, General. I'll get your tower operational. Thank you, Commander. I'll take care of things on this end. All right, let's go. I see the comm tower, to the left of the main barricade in front of Palavin. Let's go!
Liara, see if you can repair it. I'll go up and have a look. If you can keep husks from climbing up behind me, I'd appreciate it. Here they come. Ready, James? Hell yeah. Let's take them. As your partner said, succession is usually simple, but right now, the hierarchy's in chaos. So many dead are MIA. I need someone, I don't care who, as long as they can get us the Turian resources we need. I'm on it, Shepard. We'll find you the Primarch. Garrus! Vicarian, sir. I didn't see you arrive. At ease, General. You're alive. I'm hard to kill. You should know that. Good to see you again. I thought you'd be on Palavin. If we lose this moon, we lose Palavin. I'm the closest damn thing we have to an expert on Reaper forces, so I'm advising. James, this is Garrus Vicarian. He helped me stop the Collectors. He's a hell of a soldier. Lieutenant, good to see you too, Liara. Good to see you in one piece, Garrus. General Corinthus filled me in. We know who we're after. Palavan Command tells me that the next Primarch is General Adrian Victus. Victus? His name's crossed my desk. Know him, Garrus? I was fighting alongside him this morning. Lifelong military. Gets results, popular with his troops. Not so popular with military command. Has a reputation for playing loose with accepted strategy. Unconventional thinking might be the only way to save Palavin. And Earth. He'll do whatever it takes. Reminds me of an old human specter I knew. Okay, let's get him on the shuttle and get out of here. Commander! Shepard, come in! Can this wait, Joker? We're in the middle of a war zone. We've got a situation on the Normandy, Commander. It's like she's possessed. Shutting down systems, powering up weapons. I 
can't find the source. I need the Normandy standing by. We may have to bug out. Should I go back and take a look? Do it. Garrus, you said you were with Victus this morning? Yeah, but we got separated. He went to bolster a flank that was breaking. Could be anywhere out there. We're trying to raise him, Commander. Incoming Harvester! Headed for the airfield! General, tell Primarch Victus we'll rendezvous here. In the meantime, let's go take care of whatever that thing dropped off. Coming, Garrus? Are you kidding? I'm right behind you. Atmosphere's a little thinner than I'm used to, is all. Adrenaline's better than oxygen any day. <laughs> Justine, what do those reapers look like carrying? You're right, they do. We're done here. Shepard, come in. Go ahead. Still trying to raise the Primarch, but we've got trouble back here at the main barricade. If the Reapers breach it, we're done. On my way.
the word of the Primarch. Still can't get a stable comm link. Okay, I'm going on foot. Shepard out. Garrus, take me to the last place you saw Victus. How far? Should be pretty quick, unless we find trouble. there my dad a sister how bad is it three million lost the first day five the second how's your military holding up look around that should give you some idea are you putting up a good fight for now but how long does it take before the fight's kicked out if they'd only listen to your warnings about the reapers we might have been ready maybe hard to figure how you prepare for something like this Commander, you really think this summit will work? I mean, Asari? Salarians? Where's the Krogan and Batarians? Where's the meat? It's not that easy. The Batarians took the first hit when the Reapers arrived. Not much left of them. And the Krogan have never forgiven us for the Genophage. Right. Turians sterilized them. Salarians came up with it. And the Krogan hate them both for it. So they won't be joining us. Too bad. I fought with the Krogan. They're tough sons of bitches.
been a brutal fight for these guys. But the tide. General Victus? Yes? I'm Commander Shepard of the Normandy. Ah, Commander. I know who you are. I can't wait to find out what brings you out here. Vicarian, where did you go? Heavy Reaper unit on the right flank. I believe your exact words were, get that thing the hell off my men. Appreciate it. General, you're needed off planet. I've come to get you. It will take something beyond important for me to leave my men or my Turian brothers and sisters in their fight. Fedorian was killed. You're the new Primarch. You're needed immediately to chair a summit and represent your people in the fight against the Reapers. I'm Primarch of Palavan. Negotiating for the Turian hierarchy. Yes. I've spent my whole life in the military. I'm no diplomat. I hate diplomats. War is your resume. At a time like this, we need leaders who've been through that hell. I like that. You're right. And honestly, uniting these races may take as much strength as facing the Reapers. See this devastation, Primarch? Double that for Earth. I need an alliance. I need the Turian fleet. Give me a moment to say goodbye to my men. Without him down here, there's a good chance we lose this moon. Without him up there, there's a good chance we lose everything. Look at that. And they want my opinion on how to stop it? Failed CSEC officer, vigilante, and I'm their expert advisor? Think you can win this thing, Shepard? Yeah. I don't know, Garrus, but I'm sure as hell gonna give it my best shot. I'm damn sure nobody else can do it. For whatever it's worth, I'm with you. Welcome aboard. Are you ready, Primarch Victus? One thing. Commander, I appreciate your need for our fleets, but I can't spare them. Not while my world is burning. But if the pressure could be taken off Palavan... That's a pretty tall order. We need the Krogan. I can't see us winning this thing without them. Get them to help us, and then we can help you. The Krogan? Looks like your summit just got a lot more interesting. for being so frank, Commander, but your plan feels doomed to failure. We know. We've been there before. But, Madam Counselor, let me... I'm not the only one that feels this way. The Salarian Dalatras is livid. Some of these issues are hundreds of years old. Time to let go. Perhaps. Still, we can't help but feel that this summit is a waste of your time, and we can't afford to have it waste ours. We must focus our attention on the arrival of the Reapers. So no, the Asari will not be at your summit. Our alliance would be stronger with the Krogan. You need them. We all do. Good luck, Commander. And goodbye. Commander, Admiral Hackett's available on VidCon.
Commander, thank you for allowing me the use of your ship, and for going along with this plan. Gara said he had to attend to the Normandy's weapon systems. Something about calibrations. This sounds like Garrus. I'm sorry to say the Asari counselor won't be joining us. She thinks there's too much bad blood with the Krogan. She may be right, but there'll be a lot more blood. Real blood, if we don't try. And when you put it that way... The sooner we have this summit, the sooner we'll know. Is there something else I can help you with? Thank you, Primarch. My thoughts are with Palavin. And mine with Earth. Commander? Edie just went offline. What do you mean, offline? I don't know. She's not responding, and I can't access the AI core diagnostics. You better get down to deck three. Commander. Comm systems are going haywire. Whatever's happening is centered on deck three. See if you can get to Edie. I'll check the AI core. Joker, what's that sound? Fire extinguishers, Commander. Could be an electrical fire, or something. I'm going in. Edie, talk to me. Is there a particular topic you wish to discuss, Shepard? Edie? Yes. You're in Dr. Eva's body. Not all of me, but I have control of it. It was not a seamless transition. Edie, you need to alert us about incidents like this. You shouldn't have done this alone. Bringing the crew up to speed would have been counterproductive. All attempts to help would have been limited by reaction time. So if you're in there, are you still in the ship? I exist primarily within the ship. For optimal control, this unit should remain within Normandy's broadcast or tight beam range. Are you planning to take that body somewhere? Normandy's weaponry is not suited to every combat situation. This platform could provide limited fire ground support. You mean you could come with us? Correct. This body could accompany you to areas the Normandy cannot reach. I'll tell you when I need it. Excellent. I will run tests to ensure that it matches or exceeds the capabilities of organic squad mates. However, my first step should be restoring functionality to the Normandy, to reassure the crew that all is normal. Just... don't be surprised if the crew's a little wary of your new body. It was shooting at them a little while ago. An excellent point. I will take it to the bridge. Joker will also want to see it. On that, we can agree. Our 
Primarchs have been lost in a matter of hours. I know, Primarch. I'm seeing the same numbers myself. They don't look good. We have to turn this around, and fast. Well, you can trust Shepard, sir. If anybody can get the Krogan to cooperate, it's her. She's an old friend of Erdnot Rex. Let's just hope friendship still counts for something in this war. I'm sure it will, sir. Garrus. Didn't waste any time getting to work, I see. After what I've been through lately, calibrating a giant gun is a vacation. Gives me something to focus on. We're gonna need you for more than your aim. Oh, I'm ready for it. But I'm pretty sure we'll still need giant guns. And lots of them. Can't argue with that. Yeah, so... Is this the part where we... Shake hands? Wasn't sure about the protocol on reunions. Or if you even still felt the same way about me. The scars are starting to fade. I remember they drove you wild. <laughs> but I can go out and get all new ones if it'll help. I appreciate everything you've been to me, Garrus. A friend, a lifesaver, and more. But right now, I need the friend. I need you watching my back. I understand. Distractions could be dangerous at a time like this. You were never a distraction, Garrus. Well, whatever we were, I enjoyed it, Shepard. No regrets here. Never. Then, friends, it is. Now, what's this you were saying about being the expert advisor on Reapers? It's not as impressive as it sounds. I ruffled some feathers, so they gave me a token title, along with a token task force, so I'd shut up. How'd you manage that? Just followed your example, Shepard. Yell loud enough, and someone will eventually come over to see what all the fuss is about. Not that they'll actually do anything about it. Until hell shows up at their door. Then they put you in charge. <laughs> Not like the old days, is it? Rogue Spectre and CSEC agents running and gunning outside the lines, making it up as we went along. We're actually respectable now. We've lost enough friends trying to make sure this day never came. I'd say we've all earned some respect. Then the first Reaper we take out with this gun, it's in their honor. Just give the word. Something else you want to talk about? You mentioned you still had family on Palavan. My father is there. Sister, too. How long's it been since you heard from them? Long enough to be worried. I'm sure they're okay. That's the thing about getting old, Shepard. The platitudes get just as old. Pretty soon, blind hope is all we'll have left. And I hate being blind. So what's this Reaper task force you've been running? After the Collector base, I knew time was running out. For all of us. The Citadel Council was a dead end, so I did something.